Are you ready to evolve in just three days? Well, Angie Bruin and Mac Brazina join us now to talk about how one weekend can turn women into warriors. It sounds wonderful, but I know there's got to be like this whole backstory. I mean, every every woman wants to feel empowered. Everyone wants to be able to become a warrior, as you put it. How did this all come to be? Let's talk about our backgrounds a little bit and how you want to empower women. Angie? Yeah, so my name is Angie Bruin. I am an executive leadership coach. My okay. passion is for building a community of women who build other women. How did this become your passion? I worked for 18 years in corporate America, predominantly uh -huh. male dominant organizations. And in that element, you as a female executive leader are constantly trying to support and help other women thrive in that uh, in that environment. So it's been a passion for a long time. I say so you found you found your calling in mm -hmm. a way. What about you, Mac? How did you get involved in, and what was it in your life that was happening that you're like, wait a second, I can go ahead and spend some positivity towards other women? Well, that's a much longer story than we have time for. Uh, but what I tell people is that I'm a human builder. I believe in building human beings from the inside out to master their brain, body and being. So what I tell people is that I coach for mental wellness through fitness and nutrition because you can't have one without the other. So my passion is humans collectively and having been a woman that has been bullied and then as a result kind of stepped into that mean girl role to um, kind of act as like a defense mechanism even mm -hmm. in the fitness industry and not in the fitness, fitness industry. Um, I found that my passion was just finding human beings that did not know that they were awesome yet and helping them discover how awesome they really are and that they have always had this power within them. I like this. I, I really like hearing you be able to talk about people already have it with them. It's just bringing it out. Exactly. And, yeah. and you touched on corporate America. I was a female in sports broadcasting mm -hmm. for many years, so I can completely relate to that. But maybe there are women out there that are watching that are like, oh, well, I am a, a stay at home mom or I do this. This really doesn't apply to me. Why are they wrong? Why does this apply to all women to find their Inner, inner warrior. Yeah, so the first thing I would tell you, as women in general, it doesn't matter what we do, the thing that I have found to surprise me the most is that we don't give ourselves permission to evolve mm -hmm. and to lead in our own life. It doesn't matter mm -hmm. what we do. If we're a stay-at-home mom, there's things that we need to be leading in our life and give ourselves permission to evolve because when we do as women, our communities around us flourish, right? Because we are the caretakers. We care for others around us, whether that be our family, our parents, our spouses, our children, um, other women in our life. And if we don't give ourselves permission to lead and lean in to that evolution, then those around us can't flourish in the way that we want them to. Hmm. Absolutely, and when we heal one generation of of women, we heal seven before and seven after. Yeah. Really? So, yes. So we, I personally feel like a pioneer in my family tree. I know you feel the same way. And when you are able to ignite that fire within yourself and then say, okay, maybe I do have this in me. Maybe I, I don't have to follow the norm. Maybe I can honor that feminine energy and be a warrior. Maybe mm -hmm. I can be a nurturer, a lover, be filled with compassion, be a guide. Whatever and that may be. Kick butt. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> you know what yeah. I mean? In work, in the gym, out of the gym, um, regardless of what it is that lights that fire, all that matters is that it gets lit in the first place. You know, we've got actually some footage that we want to go ahead and show about some events that you've had in the past. And of course, there's one coming up, which is mm -hmm. why the both of you are here to talk about. Yes. This. Yep. And I'm assuming in your professions now working with women, you still probably hear excuses of like, oh, I don't have time to do this. Oh, I got to do my family. What do you want people at home? What's your takeaway for people watching right now before we share the event details? You're worth it. Period. You are worth evolving you're worth growing, you're worth owning your warriorship, you are worth taking control of your life and you are not destined to be a caregiver. You deserve to have your cup filled up as well. And when we fill up our own cups, along with filling up the cups of others, our cups overflow and you have no choice but to share that with the rest of the world, starting with your immediate family, your immediate social circle, your immediate tribe, and then thereby resonating with the rest of your cultural surroundings. And so Angie, along the same kind of lines, what, what do you want to leave people with when it comes to this event? Yeah, so for me as a mom, I think, and you had mentioned for that stay-at-home mom that's at home maybe yeah. watching thinking yeah. this doesn't apply, I think often we tend to use our children or family as excuses yeah. to not yes. invest in ourselves. We think if I leave for a weekend, the house is going to burn down. Yes. Now, yes. it might be messy, right? <laughs> when you come home for sure, kids might eat McDonald's every day, but yeah. at the end of the day, what they're going to get in return when you come back as your whole self mm 
um, is so much more powerful than not. Okay, well, those are two strong takeaways right there. We want to go ahead and put up the information so you can attend this event. And right now, there's no excuse because you're even getting a special offer for watching today's show, as a matter of fact. How about 10% off registration? All you got to do, visit the website on the screen so you can attend, so you can become that warrior that all of us are within. Ladies, so nice to meet you. Thank you nice so much you for too. having us. Thank you so much.